Sudden change. Daddy, calm down. What's the time? 11:30. 11 11:30, 11 and you say I should calm down. I should calm down. Look, if you find it's recent change of attitude funny, I do not. I don't. Neither do any of us, honey. We are all disturbed. But you have to take it easy with yourself before you break down. When she finally comes back, you will sit her down and know what she is up to. When will that be? When will that be? Huh? Um, Josh, call her again. She's not taking a call. Oh, your so. Call her now. Let's see. You see? Mm -hmm. uh, that is exactly what I'm talking about. And you say I should calm down. I should calm down. Now, eh? Pick your cause. Let me know what's up with you. Chama. Chama! Yes, Mama. Who are you talking with? Bequest granddaughter. Yes, Mama, she's the one. Hey! I see one more. Yes, is the one. Beke! Oh, my child! Shoma! Ha! What business do you have with member of that family? I'm asking you! Mama, it's not what you think. It's not what you think. Come back here! Shoma, come back here now! Now, I said, come here, here! What's up? What's up, religion? What business do you have with member of the family? Have I and your father not want you to stay away from any member of the family? What is your problem? Enough, Mama. Ah, enough. What is all this? Ah, I'm enough. Beke. Wait a minute. She even just walked out on me. Okay. Okay. We shall see who owns this house. If it is you or me, we shall see. My brother, you stayed longer than expected. My beloved brother, what do you expect? You know, I had to stay behind to take care of some things. And Dubai is not here, so it's, yeah, I think it's reasonable. If you go there, you finish whatever you're doing before coming back. Because of the keep here, stress and uh, old age. <laughs> <laughs> My brother, you are just a few years older and don't go there. Hey, Geneva. Okay, now let me tell you. Even if I'm what a year older than you, I can be your elder brother. <laughs> <laughs> no one is disputing that. Eh? No one is disputing that. All the same, you are highly welcome. Thank you very much. I've not seen your children or your wife. Where are they? Uh, you just missed them. 
my children went to school and my wife went to work, they really missed you. Oh, they missed me. <laughs> my people, they missed me. That's wonderful. Yeah. I, that means I, in fact, I came the wrong time. I came the wrong time. But how are they doing? Oh, we are all doing great to the glory of God. You know, the Bible says in all things, give God the glory. My headache now is just a debt. What about her? My brother, Edith has changed. Edith is no longer the girl you used to know. Can you believe that for the past two months, Edith has only been to this house three times. And each time I confront her, she apologizes, and then before you know it, she disappears again. Ha! Edith, my brother, this is unbelievable. If what you've just said is true, it means something, something deep is wrong. Something is wrong somewhere. And we have to do something about it. He did think Well, I hand over everything to God. God knows all things. Also, Chineke Man. Um, my brother, what do I get for you? You cannot well, give me one. No, 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 you cannot just go to my house. What do I get? What do I get for you? Anyway, I know what. You don't know what. I know what. You are not my wife. You are not my wife. You are not my wife. We want a woman. You are my wife. Sweetheart, how did you get in here? Were you not the one that taught me how to come in when the key is not available? <sighs> yeah, 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 that's true, that's true. This is my name. To me. How are you? I'm fine. Are you sure? Yes, I am. Okay, um... So tell me, what do I offer you? Nothing. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry for everything that happened. Come on, sweetie. It's okay. It's okay. You see what? You know I love you so much. I love you so, so much. So whatever it is, tell me. You can confide in me. And I tell you we'll sort these things together. See, you're breaking the heart of the people that cares about you. Your people are complaining. Sweetheart, this has to stop. Tell me, and much more importantly, I'm missing my woman. Please. What happened? Nothing. Nothing happened. Sweetheart. It's quite obvious to me that you don't want to talk about it. It's okay, it's okay. Since you don't want to talk about it, no problem. Huh? I want you to know that I missed you. And I missed your nose. And your smile. <laughs> That's my baby. I missed you too. Are you sure? Yes. You can say that again. <laughs> Your mother said that she caught you calling Mazibe Kwe's granddaughter on phone. Is it true? 
Oh, but is it a crime? Huh? Edith is my sister. I have business to discuss with her, so I decided to call her. Uh -huh. Did you hear? Did you hear your daughter? She is even bold enough to admit it. Imagine. Why shouldn't I, Mama? Huh? They are our extended family. Oh. I have no reason to be at war with them. It is for your own no good. Keep away from that girl. She's a very bad influence on you. Keep away, oh. Keep away from that girl. Sorry, Papa. Come. Huh? You are very stupid. You can't. Stop my game. Stop my game. You can't do what. I'm not saying you can't do what. You are very, very stupid. What are you there? What do you mean, Papa? I have warned you to stay away from them. And she is stay away from them, whether you like it or not. She is a bad influence on you. These huh? years of yours are there for decoration. I'm asking you. Are there for decoration? You, you better kill me. Huh? You will die. die. Nani. She will Nani. die. She will be ready to die. Ah, my daughter. Because I will personally strangle her to death. Yes. Stupid, stupid, stupid girl. What, honey? I find it difficult to believe all this uh, weird accusation my brother is heaping on her daughter it. it. And when she goes to her, she goes to her. You see, children of these days are so unpredictable. Not Edith that I know. Edith is the most responsible young girl I've ever seen. She used to be, I know. She's still responsible. She is. Are you trying to say that my brother is exaggerating? Yes, are you trying to say that? But I've been calling her number. She refused to pick my call. How do you explain that? I don't want this kind of thing to happen in my family. I'm so disappointed. In fact, it's disheartening. Because it did. You see it? I told you. Edith, how are you? What is happening? I've been calling your number. You refuse to pick. Saying you are sorry is not the issue. What I'm saying, why have you not been picking my calls? Okay, you know what? There is something very, very important I want us to talk about. So I want you to come to my house this evening. Unfailingly. Hey, did I say unfailingly? Okay. I'm expecting you. Till then. You see, Dito, I, I told you. I told you she is. She's responsible. What is happening? I pray she's still. No, 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 she is. Actually, I invited you here. Because I was at your place uh, last night. And. Uh, Uncle, I know what you're about to say. You know already. So yes. now tell me what I need to know. There's nothing to say to you. The only thing I want to let you know is that I'm sorry. But that does not settle anything. That does not settle anything. I know very well, down in my heart, that you have some difficulty. That there is something wrong. And I would like you to tell me so that I will know how to help you. That's why I'm asking you. I'm sorry, please. I'm so sorry. That's all I can say. Edith, you are... My niece, I love so much. Because you are a good girl. And I want the best for you. And I want you to continue being that good girl that you are. I don't want you to turn to something else. That is why I'm asking you. Asking you. And I want you to tell me the truth. The whole truth. So that we know how to come in and help you. That's why I'm asking you. Oh, I appreciate I am sorry. So this is all you have to say. <sighs> then you needed to have seen how this man was murdered. Then you will agree with me that some people are not just fit to assist. Some creatures are just demons pretending to be human beings. They don't have respect for human life. No milk of human kindness. It's just horrible. Well, this is so, so amazing. So, you said that the suspect in question is a young lady. Yes, according to the management of the hotel. Though the stupid hotel, they don't even have any security camera. 
as big as that hotel is. So there is absolutely no clue as to discover who the murderer is. But investigations are still on. I don't even have any intention of giving up hope on catching this murderer. I must catch her. Well, my brother, I wish you the best of luck. The best of luck. I noticed you've been distracted, Ben. You've been on your phone. What is going on? Well, it's my fiance. She has not been like this before. It's just that all of a sudden, she changed. I don't know what is going on. Are we talking about Christabel here? Are you kidding me or something? You know it as well as I do that I'm done with Christabel a long time ago. It's just this girl, easygoing person, but her recent attitude is really giving me cause for worry. Dude, so you have a new girl who is now on your fiance and I don't know anything about that. Okay. Come on. Guilty as charge. But come to think of it, you know how your busy schedules are. It's a long story, but I will fill you in. So, um, <coughs> you guys are quarreling or something? Not at all. We are not. You see, things have been normal for a while. But all of a sudden, she stopped picking my calls. She don't even return them. I don't know what is the problem. And you see, guy, I love this girl so much that thinking about she cheating on me would be the least of my worries. I just don't know why she has suddenly changed. You see, she possessed the quality that any man could need from a woman. That's why I engaged her. Do you need my sincere advice? Please do, brother. You engaged a girl and suddenly she started behaving strange? She doesn't pick your calls. She's nonchalant. She doesn't care. Come on, Ben. Can't you see the handwriting on the wall? She's done with the relationship and probably looking for straws to end it. And if I'm going to advise you, Ben, you end it before she ends it. But Carl, I love this girl so, so much. Ben, there is more to marriage than love. You should know that. Come in. What? Where? I'm on my way. I hope all is well. Another hope side. What? Then I'll see you later. No problem, no problem. No problem. Yeah, yes, I just finished speaking with the man in charge. He said that the ship will be arriving the port this night. So please, I want you to. Yes, I want you to clear it immediately. Because I can wait. I would like that to be in the market highest in two days' time. Because my customers can wait. They don't. They are, they, they are highly impatient. You know that's what they want. They really. They, they are really expecting the goods. You know, it's a perfect one. <laughs> so please, whatever you can do, just clear it immediately so that they will. I will sell it in two days' time. I want it to be in the market. Oh, great, great! I will be so happy. Okay, good night. Good night. <laughs> it's all right. Oh. Very urgent. The ghost will be arriving tonight. I can't wait. Me too. So that I can't wait. I can't wait too. <laughs> you know, this has literally taken almost all the money. Not almost, though. Not almost. All the money. Everything. All the money I have. But I don't want to worry myself because we'll be 100 million naira richer. <laughs> when we sell this goods. Oh, I can't <laughs> wait for that. I can't wait. You know what, sweetheart? You are the best one. 
and I have wonderful children. What I'm saying is that I've inconvenienced almost everybody in this house because of this. But I want to say this. Immediately, I sell this clothes. Everybody will be smiling to the bank. <laughs> Of course, honey. Uh, you see, you never stop taking care of us, and that is why I love you so much. You love me. <laughs> yes, honey. You love me. I love you. Now, I wanted to do something. Uh, you must show your love tonight. Not say with your girl. Not say with your girl. Let's go with that girl. Unavailable. I don't know what has come over Sister Eddie. Will you shut up your mouth? You think you can just say anything you like because you have a mouth? Don't disturb my mouth. God of mercy. Um, I think it's time for you to retire. Turn off the TV and go to your rooms. But Dad, you still want to Will you don't do as I said? Is that true? Yes, that is um, why I called you. The Commission of Police he has given us orders to publish the picture in our strategic points, the airport, taxi, any strategic area. That's interesting. Yes. So this is the the picture of the suspect. Hmm. Cool. Your phone was switched off last night. Why? Is everything all right? I have a class bathroom. Yeah, that's the reason. Mm -hmm. Oh my god! Inspector Cox, is this the suspect? Yes. Do you know him? No. This is not possible. Um, there must be a mistake somewhere. What are you talking about? Do you know this husband, did it? Do you know her? Mr. Pat, this is Miss Edith, Pastor Philip's daughter. Oh. 
Hello, Edie. Where are you? Where the hell are you? Edie, do not ask me any questions. Just tell me where you are and I'll come to you right now. Okay, just wait for me. I'll be there in the GFA. Yes, I'm on my way. Where are you? I'm here already. Where? To me. Who are you working for? Why are you going around killing innocent people? Why, Edith? I don't understand. You don't understand? Edith, this is not you. When did you suddenly change, Edith? When have you suddenly turned into such a beast? Why? What's come over you? They said, I don't know what is wrong with me. I don't know what is happening to me. But the thing is, if I tell you that I'm innocent, I didn't kill those people, you will not believe me. But I am innocent. I did not kill anyone. You are what? Innocent. You said you didn't kill them. Yet we have substantial evidence pointing against you. What evidence? You claim not to have killed him. Yet the camera caught him in that hotel with the victim in that room at the time of the murder. Edith, you said you didn't kill him. Yet you escaped from the hotel after the murder without reporting to anyone. Do you listen to yourself, girl? Do you listen to yourself? Camera caught me. <sighs> but the truth is, I did not kill anyone. Oh, it's got the crap coming out from your mouth. It's not a crap. Stacy, don't up. believe me. I did not kill anyone. I didn't kill. Listen, girl. Listen to me. The earlier you start telling yourself the truth, the better for you. Because with the situation you're into right now, I tell you, even the best criminal lawyer in the whole world cannot save you. Edith, as I speak to you, your photograph that was extracted from the camera that caught you in that hotel is in my station. Yes! It was about to be published before I admitted that I know you. You did? That was the only thing I could do to save your ass. To save your ass, girl. Oh, I did not kill. I didn't kill anyone. God damn it! I did not kill anyone. I am innocent. I didn't kill those men that died. I don't know what killed them. He's being pasted everywhere as a wanted criminal. You know what that means. The police will be everywhere looking for you as a wanted criminal. You know what that means. God damn it. What I'm doing right now, if I'm caught, I could be arrested and jailed. Stacy, but as your friend, I am here to warn you. But you don't believe me. I did not kill you. Turn yourself friends. in. Yes! Turn yourself in, Edith. And if you think you are innocent as you claim, provide me with evidence so I can report back to my superior. Damn it! This life is full of confusion. God, you are I am innocent. I don't even know why you do this. I will. Oh, I want to cry. I want to cry. Sanu me pere. 
best option. Why not, um, why not meet your friends first? I think so. Yeah. You will not understand the Mangota. I don't want anybody to mock me. You see, most of those friends you say they are good. They are there for you when the queens are good. But when the situation comes out to be like this, you see that they, they are just there to see your downfall. Honey, I, I don't like it when you have such mindset. People like BK and Austin would like to help you in this condition. Have you forgotten that five years ago you gave BK six million? Hmm? I believe if you seek for their help, they will help you. Honey, do you know I almost forgot? But at the same time, I don't want them to know that it's so tough for me now. Yes, I don't want to go to that. Honey, these are your friends. You're very good friends. I know they'll be willing to help if you seek for their help. Huh? Well, um, officers, I... I cannot say that I did not expect this. I can't. Because the edits we all know has changed. Huh? The edit we used to know wasn't like this. You cannot believe that 
For over a week now, we have not seen nor heard from her. The, the mystery here is, I don't know why she changed. Huh? She, she was never like this. Our edit was never like this. Um, nonetheless, I will do what is expected of me. Anytime she comes around, anytime we see her, I will hand her over to you quietly. I, I promise. Well, Pastor Philip, sir, we've heard what you said. We'll be waiting in anticipation. But you should know that the more she's out there, the more people's lives are endangered. We need your maximum cooperation to put a stop to the mess she has caused. This is the only way to prove to her that you truly love her. I give you my word. I will turn her in. Pastor Philip, just as you have promised, keep to your word. Well, we'll keep you posted on any further development on this matter. Do have a great day. Oh Lord, what is happening? God of justice, come to pray. Temptations and tribulations, troubles in our family. Philip warned them, we are not, I am not fine. Things are terrible here. I'm sorry I did not tell you this. And this is not what we should talk on phone. 
I want to start coming to your house now so that we'll talk about it. Yes, uh, we are all fine. We are fine. We are fine. Okay? Okay, you want to come? It better, it's still okay. So that we can sit down and talk. It's okay. What about Edith? Hello? H hello? What? Hello? Okay, I can hear you now. The network is, is bad. What about Edith? Oh, okay. It's okay. I'm, I'm, I'm waiting, please. My brother, your wife was right. She's right. You see, the bank is not your best option. You have friends, wealthy friends who you can run to for help. Yes, my brother, I have friends. I have reliable friends, even the ones I have helped. You know, when they were in problems some years past. But you see, my problem is I want to save this face. I want to no, save my face. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Forget about saving face. Look, when you go to a bank, they will demand collateral. Huh? And they will be telling you that you must pay back this and that date. It's, it's, it's all confusing. See, it's better you go to friends. Your friends will give you the money and give you a time frame. They will allow you to, to make the money back and pay them. It's a better option. Think about it. You're right. Thank you very much. Once again, I'm so sorry for what happened. Huh? But the good Lord will replenish everything that you have lost in Jesus' name. some days now. Oh, I'm fine there. I've been waiting to hear from you all this while. Before coming back to the city. So what's up? Are we good to go now? Because the company called me last night and I've been waiting to hear from you before giving them a reply. I, I, I can't really talk right now. I'm not disposed where I am. What are you talking about? This something will be working for months now. It's about to click and you're telling me this? I am sorry. I can't do that now, okay? I have a lot going on in my life. Just go ahead and handle it alone. No, no. You know I can't handle it alone. There's nothing I can do. Bye. Hello? Edith. Hello? <gasps> Eddie! Wrong with this girl. Okay. Okay. Pastor Philip's daughter. Yes. Um, Carlos, you said this was caught by the security camera. Yes, and uh, she's responsible for the previous murder in Jones Hotel. The staff of the hotel confirmed it. You see, babe, what I don't understand is why a daughter to a man like Pastor Phillips Ibegwe would go about killing people. The more I try to understand it, the more I get confused. But whatever happens, 
I must apprehend her and have her face the law. She can only run, but she can never hide. Hello, coming. Yeah? Oh, fine, I'll be on my way. Ben, I have an emergency. I want I'll give you a call. Edith, how could you? How could you mother those people? What I don't understand is why you suddenly turned into a monster. You are no longer the girl I used to know. What happened? You are not talking to me. What I don't understand is how you would take another human's life. I did not. You did not. You are expecting me to believe that. You have to believe me. I am innocent. I didn't do it. <laughs> I did not kill. I can't even kill anyone. I can barely hurt a fly and you know that. The truth is, I followed them to those hotels. But the reason I follow them or what kills them is what I cannot explain. But I am not the one. I don't know what is happening to me. You just have to believe me. I didn't kill anyone. I didn't kill anyone. I am innocent. Please. What do you expect me to believe? What do you expect me to believe? Rumor had it that you were paid to kill those people because those people were important personality in this city. No one paid me. No one paid me to kill anyone. I am innocent. I didn't kill. I can't kill. I cannot do it. Please. 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 You just have to believe me. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Didn't do it. Please. <laughs> sorry, I, I, sorry, I, I yelled at you. I'm sorry. I didn't do it. I didn't no, do I'm it. I didn't do it. I don't know who this is. Sorry, sorry. It's okay. It's okay, baby. It's okay. <sighs> I was so shocked, so, so shocked when I heard what happened to your goods. It's tragic, it's unfortunate, and I'm short of words. Your brother is unfortunate. It's heartbreaking. I'm a very clean businessman, you own No doubt, no doubt, you are. Ma, I have never shot in a little I have never compared somebody's wife. How can this kind of calamity be? Huh? Well, my brother, some days are like that, and I think you should just uh, move on with your life. No, nobody can stop me. I'm moving on with my life. I cannot be stopped by anyone, by any power. I refuse it. It's not possible. You know, that's why I'm, I was telling you, I, I need that money. Let's be with me. Yes, seriously. I need like six million naira from you, and I will pay back in four months time so that I will... I don't pay you with my six million naira. Where do you want me to get that kind of money from? Six million naira. Dicker, stop this man. But why are you telling me? I, you and I know that you are more than that. You can even give it to me ten times. I know you very well now. I am not a stranger to you. I know you very well. Hmm? Okay. What are friends for? First thing tomorrow morning, come to my office, you sign a necessary document, and I'll give you the money. You said four months. Four months. Four months. You four months, you know. That is where you go. You can't 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 go. Written agreement. Honey, do you mean that DK made you to put that in writing? Human beings are full of surprises. Oh, he is the wisest man. The wisest man on earth? That's what he is. Yes, yeah, he is the wisest man. 
somebody I gave six million naira some years back. I did not ask him to write any document. I just gave it to him because of trust. Because I have regard for relations. I gave it to him. Look at him. Now he's asking me to write agreement and all that. You see, human beings are unpredictable. That's why I told you I wanted to go to bank. Yeah. Huh? Anyway. Don't let that get into you. The most important thing is that he has given you the money. And by the grace of God, you will sell the goods and make money and pay him back. I bet you it's not going to affect your relationship with him. But he has left an impression. I mean, there's a good one for that matter. I mean, it will affect our relationship. It's not good for our relationship. You know, the annoying thing, the way he was carrying himself, that now is the, the Savior. Jesus Christ. Yeah? Ah. So you want to find a way? What next? I've made the order. And uh, the transaction now will make it immediately. And the goods will be with me in the most time. Yes. It's okay. Actually. Okay. Mom. My dear. Do you believe that David could be responsible for those killings? Honestly, my dear, I don't know what to believe in this case. I'm afraid I can't vow for her again. Mom, mm -hmm. are you implying that she could be guilty? My dear, what do you want me to say? When the police have clear evidence against her. Mom? My dear, I can't tell. It's just a big mystery to me. I love Aunt Edith so much. I don't want anything to happen to her. Nothing will ever happen to Aunt Edith. I don't care whatever anyone else thinks. All I know is that Aunt Edith is innocent. Sam, you do? Yes, I do. Okay. I also believe her innocence. Me too. You know one thing here. We all have to pray collectively for her. I think that's what we will do. Oh, this is not right. This is not right. Please shut up, Mr. Supervisor. What is wrong with you? Do you understand the consequences of obstructing and ruining the investigation? Do you understand that? Now, will you take me to your manager? And I need a surgery. Right. Now, both.
Samoa. Can you believe that the police came to our house a few hours ago? The police? Yes. Why? It seems like they ran into Sister Edith. So they came to the house to tell that that he has just three days to provide her. If not, they would arrest him. So what has your dad got to do with that? They believe we are hiding her. Hiding her? But you guys have not seen her. We've not set eyes on her for some days now. She's hiding from everybody. She doesn't want to get caught. That isn't the solution. The best thing for her to do is to surrender herself to the police. What? Then go to jail? Of course she will definitely go to jail. Wait a minute. Do you by any means believe that Sister Edith is guilty as reported? Do you believe otherwise? When clear evidence and facts are standing against her? You're talking about my sister here? Yeah? yeah, I know. I strongly believe that Sister Edith is innocent. Eddie! to her this afternoon? Yes, um, but she escaped. She escaped? How could you lose her like that? Come on, Stacy. That girl is a professional criminal. You should have seen her run. Hmm? She runs faster than you said bored. Hmm. But not faster than my bullet. What do you mean by that? I shot her. You what? Ah, no, Inspector, just tell me you're joking. Do I look like a joker, Stacey? I told you I shot her and she escaped. How could you do that? It hasn't gotten to that yet. What if you had killed her? Come on, she's a murderer. She alleged. is a murderer. She's alleged to I, be. See, I don't understand you, Stacey. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Are you on the side of law or are you on the side of this girl? See, all evidence point at her. The fact that she's been trying to escape is enough evidence to apprehend her. That is not enough reason for you to shoot at her. To shoot on sight order hasn't been placed on her yet. Whatever. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not telling you. Don't shoot this girl. You are unbelievable! Ah! You're okay now. You're lucky the injury you sustained was minor. But you'll be fine in a couple of days. I pray so. Thanks so much. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Sure. Why did you learn how to do this? I'm surprised you asked. Have you forgotten? One sentence. Oh, you nurse. My bad. I forgot you're a nurse. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate I wonder what I would have done without your help. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. So, are you ready to talk about it now? Talk about what? 
What happened to you? Who shot you? I'm sorry, I can't talk about it. Like seriously? Seriously. There's nothing to talk about. All the same. Thanks. Thank for helping me out. You're my sister. So my brother, you were able to raise the money? Yes. I said matter of fact. I made a transaction today. And I'm expecting the goods first week of next month. Oh, that is good news. Oh, glory be to God. My brother, you shall rise again. Amen. The devil cannot hold you down. He cannot. <laughs> and uh, how is uh, this case? <sighs> My brother, it is getting worse. Hi. The, the police paid me a visit today. They said I have three days to provide it. It seems that they ran into her and she escaped from them. My brother, I, I don't understand. I, I don't know. I don't know why Edith has chosen to bring a disgrace of such magnitude upon my good name. I, I don't deserve this. My brother, tell me, where did I go wrong? I've always been a responsible father in the in the beginning in the beginning as i raised them i've always had this bible verse in mind proverbs 22 6 train up a child in the way he should go and when he is old he will not depart from it my brother where did i go wrong where where uh, my brother is okay philip just go down. I don't go. I know how you feel. I know how you feel. Even myself, I know how I'm feeling about it. You know, when I look at her sometimes, I say, whether it's juvenile deliverance. But this is more than that. I think this has some spiritual undertone. But all I want you to know is that we will conquer. It is a harmless person. So for this kind of thing to, don't worry. Everything will be taken care of. Eh? Just put yourself together. Hi! <gasps> mm. Ben, I don't need any drink. I'm okay. Very, very okay. Come on, Carlos. You're my friend. And I know you're poisoned. Don't worry, let me just fix you up. Get something. Come on, Ben. Stop. I have a policy. I don't drink when I'm walking. Besides, it's not proper for a detective like me to take something that is capable of altering my CNS when I'm walking. We call that serious misconduct. Please, can you spare me the sum? You're my friend. You understand? And I see no reason why you'll be walking at this time of the night. It's late already, my brother. Yes, I'm still walking, as a matter of fact. I've sworn not to rest until I apprehend that pastor's daughter. And I must do it. Even if that is the last thing I'm gonna do. Ah, that's right. Uh, you mean you, you are still bent on arresting this girl? Like I said before, I am not going to rest until I apprehend her. See, people like her are supposed to be arrested, tried and convicted. She's a threat to human life. As long as she's allowed to be roaming about the street free. So I must do everything within my power. To arrest her. I must. Well, um, that's, that's nice. Um, actually, guys, the reason why I called you here, I want us to have a heart-to-heart -heart talk. I'm all here, so what are we talking about? You see, um, um, I want to sell.
Do you know the implication of what you did? <sighs> That's... Shut up, Ben! Do you know I can actually arrest you for aiding and abating crime? That's the reason. Shut up, Ben! <laughs> And why do you come through the back door? Tell me what I need to know. What is going on? Who shot you? I can't talk about it now. No, you must talk about it now. No, I can't. I can't. Christ, I'm sorry to disappoint you. I can't talk about it now. You need to see me again. My Dad, I'm sorry. Of course you are. Of course you are. You should be sorry. You should be sorry for me. You should be sorry for yourself. You should be sorry for yourself and your life which you have messed up. Dad, I didn't mess up my life. I didn't. If I tell you that I'm innocent, will you believe me? Of course you know I cannot believe you. Dad, but you have to. You have to believe me. I am innocent. I didn't kill anyone. I didn't kill any of those men that died. I did not, Dad. I am innocent. What did you just say? Mom, I said I didn't kill anyone. I didn't. If you did not kill those men, then who did you? Tell us what happened, daughter. Sorry. Please make us understand you. Please open up to us. Because in own them. I wish I know what to tell you. I can't explain it, Dad. I don't know what happened. But the truth is, I didn't kill any of those men that died. But no one seems to believe me. What everyone believes is what the report says. Oh, That's spare me that nonsense. Truth. Spare me that nonsense. Were you or were you not at the hotel with those men at the time of the incident? That I was with them, but... But what, Edith? Edith, what? How could you, Edith? What were you doing in the hotel with those men? You, Edith, daughter of Pastor Philip. Have you forgotten where you come from? Have you? Edith, I raised you well. I did my best to raise you well. Take a look at the Bible. Pick up this Bible and open to 1 Corinthians 3 16. Pick it up and read! Read 3 16 to 17. Surely, you know that you're God's temple and that God's spirit lives in you. So if anyone destroys God's temple, God will destroy him. For the God's temple is holy and you, yourself, are his temple. But I know what the scripture says. I did not do it. I did not kill anyone.
Please put yourself together. I don't know what exactly is going on, but whatever it is, it's not the end of the world. So stop baby, okay? It's okay, it's okay. Sleep. Come in so can you refresh yourself. It's okay. Oh Lord, what is happening? God of justice, come to our aid. Temptations and tribulations, troubles in our family. is happening to me. I did not kill any of those that died. And no one seems to believe me. Uncle Yami doesn't. I think he's stronger and the strange power has taken over me. Yes, this is not me, Uncle. This is not me. Something is wrong somewhere. You know me very well. I can barely hurt a soul. Let alone Hurting my own loved ones. I can't do it. No one seems to believe me. My father believes I am doing this to bring him down or to dent him. But it's not true. I don't know what is happening to me. I am innocent. I don't know. Uncle, I came to you because I believe you are the only one that can believe and trust me. Yes. I've come to tell you the truth. I didn't kill them. I didn't kill any of them. And I don't know who did. Ben, why? Why didn't you tell me you have something going with this girl? How could you hide such a thing from me, Ben? I'm sorry, Cars. Actually, I was about telling you before the incident. This is the same girl I told you about, my fiance. And you've been harboring her all this while? Ben? Are you mad? You've been harboring a wanted person? A notorious criminal in the name of fiance? I'm sorry, Carlos. But believe me, Edith is innocent of all the allegations leveled against her. That's why I trust her. Is that what she told you? Of course. And I believed her, bro. I believed her. I believe she's innocent. I believe that she's harmless. You need to understand this, man. See, listen to me, man. The worst mistake you will make in your life is to trust that girl. That girl is a green snake in the green grass. She, 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 she's a complete definition of terror. She's a wanted person. She's a notorious murderer. She has no respect for human life. Oh, for Christ's sake, huh? You will still repeat it over and over again. She can't do a thing like that. But come to think of it, why would she do such thing? Because some human beings are just incomprehensible. Remember, human behavior is more probabilistic than predictable. For all I care, she could kill for so many reasons. She could kill for fun. She could, she could kill for money. She could kill for... Cars, 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 please. We will repeat this over and over again. As a friend, let me tell you something. You have the wrong person. You are the person who has the wrong person here. Eh? And listen to me. The reason I'm not arresting you right now is because you're my friend. Consider this a chance. Consider it. You need to hand her over. That girl is a die-hard criminal. She, she doesn't have respect for human life. If you love her like you claim, 
The only thing you can do is to have her behind bars. You hand her over. This is the last time I'm telling you this, man. I'm not going to warn you again. I'm serious. I'm not going to warn you again. The next time I tell you about Edith, you will not like me. And I'm very serious. Oh Lord, what is happening? God of justice, come to light. Temptations and tables. You are harmless, I know. What do you know? Is this? Oh, 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 oh. What is that? Did you have a wound? What happened? Huh? My baby, what happened? I was shot. Shot? Who did it? Who shot you? I was shot by the police. Ah. I'm sorry. I'm getting enough treatment. I'm getting enough treatment. Ah. I'm good. Wait. Are they? I'm sorry. What is going on? I heard you talking. I see a whole lot of problems in my life now. Most times I think aloud. I solo look wise. That's just the problem. some time now. You are alone. And you know it's not proper for a beautiful creature like you to be alone drinking in a busy bar like this. So I was just wondering, wondering if I can join you. I like company. Together we can make it hotter and busier. That is if you don't mind. I've been trained right from childhood to be gentle on my ladies. Can I see? Get your empty hands off me! Excuse me. Oh, Did you just do that? Ready? How are you today? I'm fine, sir. That's right. Um, okay. you'll get me in my usual, okay? Okay, sir. Alright. One again, one more, 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 I just came to apologize. It's okay, sir. Please sit down here and make yourself comfortable. Don't worry. I am fine here. Really? Yes. That's good. You're welcome. Thank you. Yes, oh, you're careful. Thank you. I care for money. Mm. So? I doubt if you can pay my bill. How much is your bill? Just name it. I take hard currency. Yeah? Five thousand dollars. Five thousand dollars? Yes. What's the deal? Deal with If you had known me, you wouldn't have walked out on me at the first place. I'm sorry about that. It's okay. I appreciate a love gentleman like you. See, oh, yeah. Deal. Holly, you mean she said all this? Yes, my dear, but even if she didn't say all those things, 
I noticed it. I noticed it. That girl really needs help. Yes. So what kind of help are you talking about now? I'm talking about spiritual help. Spiritual help. But what bothers me most is her father is a powerful man of God. I wonder why he has not noticed that. Huh? That girl is possessed by a strange power that is pushing her to do things she's not used to. My God. Does it mean she really killed those men? Maybe yes, maybe no. But the most important thing is this. He did need help. She's so dear to us. She's so dear to everybody. She's a wonderful girl. So I can't just understand why we should allow this strange power that is far more stronger than her to destroy her. We have to do something to help her. That's just my concern. Well, I guess there's nothing we can do here since the father is a pastor. I think he can handle it. We still have a role to play there. Yes, if not anything, the legal aspect of it. Or have you forgotten that the police are looking for her everywhere? Yeah. Why if you say so? Hi. Okay. Oh. Understand me. There must be a mistake somewhere. Because the edit I know cannot do such thing. Don't tell me that bullshit, man. Don't tell me that. The scene alone is pretty definitive for her style of murder, and all accusing finger point at her. I witnessed, said, they saw her walk into the hotel with Chief Maxwell. Hold on. You meant the famous Chief Maxwell? Yes, Chief Maxwell. Can't you see she knows what she is doing? She's obviously working for someone. And I need to arrest her for me to get to that son of a bitch she's working for. And I must arrest her. My God. See that? As a friend, I've really tried for you. I've condoned you. I'm giving you 24 hours to provide her. Otherwise, about killing innocent people senselessly. Why, Edith? I didn't kill that woman. Jesus! Shut up and save your friend. Because I didn't invite you here to listen to that crap one. I am here to take you to the station. Stay. 
Lisi, you want to arrest me? Didn't I ask you to turn yourself in? Evie, didn't I ask you to provide me an evidence to prove your innocence? That if your innocence has claimed, why are you still going about murdering people? Why? Stacy, you know me very well. Stacy, you are my friend. You know I can't harm anyone. I do not know you anymore, Evie. You are not the girl I used to know. I once knew an innocent, loving and harmless girl. Not this die-hard muscular I have standing before me. Stacy! Stop! Stop! Pick up the key. Right now. Pick it up. I said pick the key and drive. Right now. You're making a mistake. Do not underestimate me. Try to play pranks with you. You know what I'll do. Get into the car. I didn't kill you. Right now, you did. Stacy, I did not. Hold me up! This life is full of confusion, temptation, all over the nation. Oh, should I cry? Should I weep? Oh, I want to cry. I want to cry. Sanume Oh, my God, you go, give me a come again, man. I want you to give me a come again, give me a come again, why are you making me go through this? You never know. Get out! Is it? I don't want to ever see you again. If I set my eyes on you, even from a distance, I will not arrest you. I will shoot you! Get out! Get out! Why God? Why? What have we done to deserve this? What have we done? My own daughter shedding blood. What have we done to deserve this? Where did we go wrong? God, where? God, have you in your anger cast us away? Why? What did we do?
what is happening? God of justice, come to light. Temptation to dream of actions. So you're welcome. Um, how are you? I'm fine. I hope all is well. Yeah, all is well, uncle. Um, I'm here to see you, Diti. She ain't. Oh, she's not there. Ah. Uh, I was supposed to meet her today, and I didn't see her. And she's not taking her calls either. So I decided to come around and see if all is well with her. Really? Yeah. Uh, all is well. Uh, it's quite unfortunate. Edith is not home right now. Okay. Um, um, uncle, you don't look alright. Are you? Is there a problem? Oh, there's no problem. I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. Everything is alright. We're fine. Um. Get her something to drink. Are you saying you've not seen Edith for some days now? Of course I've not seen her. In fact, I've been trying to reach her, but her number is switched off. Um, why did you ask? Did you go to her place? Of course I did. I'm just coming from her house, and they say she wasn't there. Neither would they say where she was. I just got this feeling that all has not been well with Edith. Pardon my curiosity, but why would you think a thing like that? I met her yesterday, and she looks like one into trouble. I'm sorry, my dad. I seriously don't understand what you meant by that. She... She was shot. What? I think she was trying to escape from someone, and she got shot. She, she, she was shot? She was shot. Are, 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 you, are you sure of what you're saying? Of course I am. I was the one that rescued her, took her home and got rid of the bullet. Yet she wouldn't tell me what I need to know. I'm sorry, my dear. You said you were just coming from her place. And her people don't know of her whereabouts. Yes. That is why I'm here. Edith, where are you, baby? Where are you? Hello, Carl. You've not been making my call since morning. What is it? Then why are you calling me by this time of the night? I've been trying to reach you since morning. Did you call me to tell me that you've gotten Edith? Uh, that's by the way. I was informed that Edith was short. Do you know anything about it? Yes, I ran into her. She tried to escape and had no option. Now to shoot her. You did what? Cops. Tell me something. You mean you are the one who shot Edith? Ben, I hope you understand the implication of her already suspect. I hope you do understand that. Now, Ben, listen to me very carefully. She was very lucky she escaped that. Next time, she might not be that lucky. If you truly love her, advise her to talk herself in. Otherwise, the next time, it will be her course. Hey, 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 listen, you don't hang up on me! Hello? Hello, cops? Philip Sibekwe, you are under arrest for aiding and abating a fugitive. You have the right to remain silent because anything you say will be used against you in the court of law. What? Oh, God. Oh. 
any way we have sinned against you, please forgive us. Forgive us and bring my edits back. Bring my edits back. Bring my edits back. Everything is turning against us. Everything is turning against us. Everything, everything is turning against us. You need an apple when you can It's okay, my mom, it's okay. You need to rest now, okay? Let's go inside. I don't want to rest. I don't want to rest. I don't want to rest. Okay. Oh Lord, what is happening? God of justice, come to our aid. Temptations and tribulations, troubles in our family. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, yeah, well, well, Why, Dad? They think we are hiding you. And so they arrested him because they believed that he would bring you out. You have to go to the police station and tell them what the problem is. Tell them what is going on because you alone know what is going on. I can't turn myself in. You can't turn yourself in? So Dad should suffer for something he knows nothing about?
You will never die in the name of Jesus. Amen. very difficult for me to turn myself in for something I did not do. I'll be convicted. I have no strong proof of my innocence. No one believes me. The police believe I killed those men because they have substantial evidence against me. I didn't kill them. No one wants to understand or believe me. Even my own bosom friend Stacy. She didn't believe me. She has threatened to kill me if she ever sets her eyes on me again. Hey! I am so devastated. I don't know what to do. This is something very serious. So, this is something very difficult. But, Edith, don't you think, you know, you cannot hide forever. You cannot continue to do it. Yes. I'm... So, listen to me. Don't you think it's better you turn yourself in? Yes. No, what I mean is this. Listen, listen to me. What I mean, if you turn yourself in, I will not go for the most powerful criminal attorney. That will take care of you. Uncle, that wouldn't do. I will still be convicted for sure. The least I can get is leniency. But, but it's something. It's nothing. Uncle, believe me, it's nothing because I am being punished for something I never did. I did not kill those men. I did not kill anyone. I can't even kill. Oh, you just have to... Are you seeing it? What is this? Jesus. What is this? Jesus. Jesus. Okay. What is it? What is it? I, I hope my is alright. Shut up. You know, send up your house today. If you don't shout, now this cell you go just see yourself. Officer, it's okay. It's okay. Huh? Give me one yo. Give me one yo. My brother, just take it easy. No, it's not Papa. No, Papa. What is it? You're, you're a man. You're a servant of God. And I know God will give us, give you the heart to be. A... What is it? Oh, my brother. It's your, your last son, Jephthah. He's dead. Which Jephthah? My, my, my own Jephthah. Just yeah, be a year. <laughs> Jephthah is dead. Ah, what happened? Okay, where? Where? What happened? Your wife said that they were in their various rooms. And of, all of a sudden, he screamed. They came out and saw him lying in the pool of his own blood. Jesus Christ of Nazareth, why? Why? Me and Mom, Joseph together. You see, Carl, I would like to crave on your indulgence to please have a little think on this matter. Release that old man in your custody because keeping him here is the high level of degradation. He has absolutely nothing to do with this case. And I don't know why you 
arrested him in the first place. You see, um, Ben, the reason I'm listening to you is because you are my friend. There is this saying that if you want to catch a hen, you use the chicken. I've learned that Edith loves the father very, very much and cannot bear to watch the man suffer for a crime she wittingly committed. As long as the father is here, she will show up. Trust me on that. Come on, Cass. This is crazy. You need to have a rethink here. This is a noble man. And what you are doing to him is the high level of degradation. Please, Cass. You see, Ben, this noble man you've been talking about with so much respect has failed to bring up a responsible child. Bring up a child in a way he will follow so that when he grows up, he will not depart from it. Proverb 22, 6. Pastor Philip has failed to adhere to this biblical passage, which I'm sure he preaches to the people every day. Come on, Kazmaier. You see, are... Ben, I'm very, very busy, as you can see it. Just pray that Edith shows up. Otherwise, you will be sad and Why is that? So Edith is here to see you. What?
Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Father, you are the King of kings and the Lord of lords. Jehovah, I glorify your name for you are the almighty God. You are changing the name of Jesus. Do not be afraid. It is time for us to tell the devil that enough is enough. The battle is not ours. The battle is of the Lord's. For it is written that surely they will gather, but because their gathering is not of the Lord's, they will scatter. No soul in this family shall be taken or tormented by any contrary spirit again in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. We shall overcome in Jesus' name. Amen. It is time for us to invite the Holy Spirit to come and dwell permanently in our family in Jesus' name. Amen. Philip, one name. Amen. Amen. Please hear me invite Many invite me. Because. However, many invite Hey. It's okay. Stop crying. It's okay. How are you? I miss you. Don't miss me. Baby, you know it's not possible. No matter how hard I try, it's not possible. We all miss you. Your family and I are working earnestly to make sure that this does not end We want to get the best criminal lawyer to handle this case. So come with you. I am innocent. Remember. I'm doing your part. I know that. I know that. You see, your father had a revelation that there is a certain spirit behind all what you people are going through. Seriously? Yes. And we have decided to embark on a serious praying and fasting to deliver your father. I knew it. I knew this is coming. I knew something is wrong somewhere. And I can't place my hand on that. That's why we want to fight this together. So. Ada, your dad is saying you should cook rice and sauce for him. For me, go and fry black thing for me.
Suffering from a deep problem. Now we need more prayers, honey. We need more prayers. Seriously, let us be stronger than we were. People. Yeah. Hello, Bob. Ah, uh, Are we all right? I just spoke with Father few minutes ago. Father, he summoned us to the village. And what could that be? I don't know. When we get to the village, we'll know. Um, okay, well, when do you want us to go? Um, tomorrow will be convenient for me. I don't know about you. Okay, tomorrow is fine. Tomorrow is fine. Uh, we meet then. Okay, that'll be tomorrow then. It's okay. Okay, then tomorrow. Tomorrow morning, yes. Okay, bye bye. Okay. Uh...
concerning all the things that have been happening in this family. Eh? It's, it's not funny. And you're, you're not saying anything. Even my son, I'm even as confused as you are. Do you know that recently, Uchenna's husband brought her home based on a fifth miscarriage? And the other embarrassing aspect of it is that every diviner, pastor, spiritualist, or whatever blamed all these woes on the same Uchenna. That is exactly what has been happening to Mecca. That's it! Do you know, to crown it all, about two weeks ago that I came here, I found all my goats, sheep, fowl, and other animal husbandry dead. Sweetheart, what happened? Did they release you? Uh, no, they didn't. Oh, I don't understand. What do you mean, no? I escaped. You escaped? But, but, but how is that possible? The oracle helped me to escape. When did it happen? A few hours ago. I'm sure the police will be searching everywhere for me. I'm so scared right now. I don't know what to do. Are you expecting someone? Ben! Ben, open this door! Ben, open this door! I'm coming, I'm coming! I don't understand. Why are you searching my house like this? I hope all is well. Ben, are you aware that Edith escaped police custody? Are you aware of that? I don't understand. She escaped. How do you mean? Ben, Edith escaped police custody. I don't know how that happened. She escaped mysteriously. Don't pretend as if you don't know what I'm talking. I don't know, neither. I don't see how that is possible, my brother. How is that possible? Are you trying to tell me that you've not seen me edit? Are you by any chance suspecting me? I've not said so, Ben. I only asked you if you've seen her. And let me remind you, Ben, that hiding her is a more dangerous thing to do. And anybody who tries that will have himself to blame. That girl is the most wanted criminal in town who just escaped custody and on the verge of that, few of my men died. Anybody who is found guilty of hiding her will be treated as an accomplice. The person will be arrested and charged to court. And I'm sure, my dear friend, that you don't want that to be your fate. Cause, for the fact that you're my friend, I would appreciate it if you don't cross your jurisdiction. I hope you didn't come here to threaten me. Ben, I am not threatening you. I am just stating the obvious. And let me tell you, if I find out that you are hiding it, you will have yourself to blame. Really? Ah. 
Good thing you know your way out. was a native doctor in the dream. A native doctor? Yes. Uh, how is that possible? I don't know. I saw myself invoking some powers. And the confusing part of it is that it's in our village house. In the village. <laughs> Under this certain tree. Gosh, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I don't want to be a native doctor. Am I going to be a native come, doctor? Come on, come on, sweetheart. It's not possible. It's not possible. You see what? Um, I think, um, you see what? It's, it's just a mystery, okay? Probably you are homesick and uh, you know... No, it's love. not that. Stop. I am not kidding. I'm serious. It's okay, darling. It's okay. You know, a lot has been happening lately. Okay, okay come on, sleep with me. Just think of me. I tell you. I cover us with the blood of Jesus. Amen. Lil, stop worrying yourself. Stop worrying yourself. Chica is a very good mechanic. He will do the car very well. Now, let's use these guys and get on course. See, the thing is, uh, that car is not supposed to develop anything. I just bought it. But I don't want to. I don't want to get it. I don't want to get it. I don't want to get it. It will be taken care of. You know, you know that this is temptation. Huh? Okay. Don't get it. So you bring the car back to the town to me or I have to go? I've been doing things with him. Either you, if you like to go, you go and take the car. But if I call him and the car is okay, then I would ask him to bring it. He will bring it to you. You need a mother The problem is, I am not an So, I don't want to be honest. Let's take it and do it. I don't have to. All right. 
I will not be judged. My name is Jebelike. Tell that God I call you that something is going wrong. God will have to do something. And almost when I borrow it, I'm out for more. This is why I think. But I will not borrow it. It's just that you see the other people. Someone is a father. Hello? Yes, who is this? Yes, this part of this wife. What happened? My husband? Which hospital? Okay, okay, okay. I'm on my way, I'm on my way, I'm on my way. Yes, yes, I'm on my way. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Jesus Christ! Last year, I and Edith was here to celebrate your birthday with you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Stupid of me. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> I remember giving you a lift to the mechanic. Oh, sure. <laughs> you have a good memory. Yeah. And that was where we exchanged numbers. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> okay, come in and make yourself comfortable. Thank you. Um, Thank you. Um, Detective Stacy. Yeah. <laughs> so, how may I help you? Um, I'm here to see Edith. Um, is Edith around? Oh, as you can see, she's not here. Hope all is well. Um, sure, all is well. I actually went to her father's house to look for her, but she wasn't there. Met her absent, so I thought she was here. That was why I came. Oh, sorry, she's not. I have not heard from her for the past few days now. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Let me not take much of your time. Okay. Uh, yes, yeah. I should be on my way now. You sure all is well? Oh, all is well. When you get in touch with Gilly, tell her to take this Stacey over here. I sure will. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. <laughs> you sure all is well? Yes. 
There should be any moment. Okay, thank you. Tell me everything I'm supposed to know. How did you escape? I don't know how it happened. Are you alone? That is not the answer to my question. Of course you should know that you can hide from everyone, but you cannot hide from me. How did you do it? I don't know what happened. Honestly, I don't know. Edie, are you possessed? That's the same question I've been asking myself. I don't know what is going on lately. I didn't kill anyone. They say you know me very well, I can barely hurt a fly. I did not kill those men. Not even the policemen, not no one. How do you expect me to believe that? Stacey, you have to believe me. I didn't kill anyone. I think there's a spirit behind all this. Ah. Okay, fine. Let me ask you. How can I possibly kill those trained policemen? Can I do that alone? I don't know how they died. I don't know what killed them. The only thing I know is that when I saw them dead, I had to run for my life. Because if I didn't, they would accuse me of killing them. Edie, are you sure you're telling me the truth? Stacey, I am being sincere with you. I did not kill anyone. Jenny. Girl, you sound convincing. But I need facts. I need facts to prove your innocence. Or else, I will be forced to shoot you myself. Stacy! I will! And that's a warning. God damn it. How is your house? As you can see, I am getting better than all of us to be discharged. That's why I'm here. I'm getting better. Uh, they discharged my brother two days ago. I was even earlier than my brother. Uh, but uh, all of a sudden, my BP went up. So that's why I'm. But I'm getting better now. I'm getting better. Now, um, Mameka, I want to tell you this. Uh, you are a wonderful woman, babe. Mm -hmm. Yes, he is. You know, uh, since you left this hospital, you've been coming to see me. See how I'm doing? That shows you are a good person. I am very, very happy. I say, God will continue to bless you. And I will advise you to keep that character. He's a, good, he's a good one. And, and uh, how much do you say the mechanic charged for the repair? Chief. Chief, 
the your health is the most important thing. But nevertheless, the mechanic said the whole thing will cost a total of sixty hundred and sixty thousand naira. Hundred and sixty thousand naira. Yes. 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 The whole month of God damaged. Hundred and sixty thousand is a big money and it's also a small money. What is hundred and sixty thousand when I used to be one higher? Yes. Uh, but, uh, at the same time, I will still do something, something reasonable. I'll give you something reasonable to make up with the one you have. Oh, thank you, Chief. I'm so happy. Keep it up, bro. Thank you, Chief. Keep it up. I just want to be calm because my BP is going high. But I know it will normalize. Yes. Um, I have no. Sir? Uh, you know, I told you you should not. I hope you did not uh, collect anything for him. No, no, sir, I did not. So how much is the whole bill, the, the bill? Um, including that of your brother. Yes, everything. Everything is 52,500, sir. 52,500. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, before I leave, I uh, will give you the whole money. Okay, sir. It's okay, Emeka. Sir. Uh, it's uh, just like, life is all about Hello? give and take. Hello. I don't go to China, but I want to Okay, hold well on. Honey, huh? Mr. Johnson. Oh, Mr. Johnson. Oh, Mr. Johnson. <laughs> Mr. Johnson. Oh, oh, well, fine, oh, fine. Uh, it is okay. I say it. Whatever. Oh, that's not normal. Well, what is that? Just tell me. Huh? What? receiving a call from his clearing agents. He was told that the ship carrying his goods capsized in the sea. Oh my god. Oh my god. No 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 that's not possible. That's not oh god 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 why 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 hey that's not possible yeah hey god why 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 hey why, why, why is all this happening to my brother? Oh, you know, what is all this? Why in God's name? What? What is all this? How is he? God is there for us. Nothing will happen to him. He's a good deal. Sorry, no? I don't know what we have done no. <laughs> to deserve our name. Stop worrying. It's okay. He's just borrowed that money, yo. I know, I know, I know. He has not done anything wrong good to anybody. <laughs> stop, stop lying. God is in control of our situation. He knows everything. He didn't do anything wrong, girl. Honey. Oh. Since it's obvious that the oracle is behind our misfortune, what can we do to, to fight it? My dear, if fighting the oracle is my main concern now, it means I'm stupid. Because I know it's going to be a lost battle. My main concern now is how to get revived. Yes, how to get back to my feet. That is my main concern. Chief, how did you do? Do you Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. You're welcome. Thank you. 
Excuse me, sir. You're welcome. Nikke, you are highly welcome. You are highly welcome. Nikke, ma, who one name Nikke? I wanna an age also, also a name. You know, and but and I thank God you are the kind of person I know that will understand me and my predicament. Yes, you know what I'm trying to explain is that uh, it did not work out the way we planned. So I am, I'm, I'm the person, you know, I want you to be with me. I am very sorry and uh, I believe God. In like five months time, I can be able to. Be what did I hear you say? Oh, we say in the next five months, I will, be, you know, clear everything. Five what? Five months. Five months. Five what? Five months. I should give you five months for you to pay me back my money. You see, that's why when people want to order for help, they won't. Listen, my friend, if you don't give me my money back, I will just, I will just give you two weeks. Two weeks! And you don't give me my money back! Hey, I'm here to give me the You're not talking to your friend that gave you this million naira. Where is the side? What are you That's the person that you're talking to. I was there! This is now! I need my money! If you don't give me my money back, you may make it up. Look at this part! Like this. You have us. I have everything. I can't believe it. I am confused. Hey! Excuse me. Does it mean he's laughing at us or what? Hello? Hello? Who do you want to Calm down, calm down and talk to me. What is it? What? Your husband arrested. Why? there right away. Calm down, okay? Don't worry, I'm coming there. Okay, please, I'm coming there. It's okay. My brother was that my brother was just arrested by his friend, the guy who's going some money. But I thought both of them are friends. I do so too. I just don't understand. I, I, I have to, I have to. This young man has taken us to too far. Huh? I thought he was your friend. Look, I know that the time he gave you has elapsed, but uh, this is this is too much because I remember you told me there was a time you lent him six million naira and you give him enough time to uh, to repay you. So why why is he doing this to you now? What else? To humiliate me and to announce to the whole world that I'm doomed. But I thought he was your friend. That was when the girl was good. Anyway. I will refund him his money. But how are you going to go about that? I have to blow that GRA. 
and I've put them for sale. I've also asked my lawyer to sell my share at Hilton Group of Company. But isn't that a bit extreme? That's, that's too much. No, you don't say that. You don't say that. Whatever I can do to save the situation, I have to do it. I don't want to enter the cell. That's the last thing I want to I don't, I don't want to stay behind this counter more than 24 hours. I don't want it. So please, I want you to meet my lawyer. Follow him up so that they will sell these this shares immediately. I have to go. I have to come out of this place. Um, I will do my best. I'll get in touch with you. So, Bob is finally out. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. And he has settled the young man. Oh, God, I really thank you. I pity him because there was nothing I could do to help him. Hmm? The plots of land he sold and those shares, he never really wanted to touch them. That was why he had to borrow money from a friend in the first place. My brother has lost money because the two plots of land he sold, he bought each of them for three million naira, and now he ended up selling them for two million naira. Right. Anyway, the good Lord will give me a better replacement. Amen. I have told my brother not to buy any more goods till we uproot that evil altar in our family compound. For it is written in Mark 16, 17. That he that believeth and is baptized has the authority to cast out demons and devils. Yes. That we shall speak in tongues. That we shall trample upon snakes and scorpions and no harm shall befall us. That we shall drink deadly things and nothing will happen to us. Yes. That we have the power to lay hands on the sick and they shall be healed in Jesus name. Amen. That altar must go. All we have to do is just be prayer. Yeah, my God. The good Lord will never let us down. Victory must be ours. Buddy, I think the pastor was right. You know, it would be stupid investing into another business again. Since we all know that the, the oracle is behind all this. Um, I think the best thing would be to get rid of the oracle first before any other thing. Sweetheart. I don't think so. No, nothing will stop me from investing my money. Yes. Egon and Mother Adano. You know that. I have to invest my money just because of mere dream. No, 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 I have to. You know, I'm not uh, disputing what the pastor said. I'm not. Uh, it's possible what he said is true. But all I'm saying is this. Let me import the goods. Before the goods arise, then they must have find a way to deal with the oracle or destroy the oracle before the goods arise. But my, 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 I work for more again. Eh? And then I tell him, no, no, I can't. I'm not I have to invest it. Well, this thing is, I'm just getting tired of the whole thing. You don't have to. You don't have to. Well, um, if you think so. Yeah, I think so. Whatever 
prayer. Hey! Okay. Oh, Papa, you can move for now. This is exactly what my wife is suffering from now. Hey! solution to all this. Eh? We need prayers to withstand it. Prayer is the key. Mm. In that case, I know what to do. Yes, I know what to do. You know, you know to take my wife to another dimension, uh, spiritually, so that she'll be healed. I think that's what I'll have to do. I don't understand you. It's very, very simple for you to understand. From what you're saying now, you are spiritualizing this as a man of God. And our prayers is not effective to uh, heal our wives. So the best thing is to go for another spiritual way. Whatever, all we need is healing. But what are you saying? What are you talking about? What I'm talking about is simple, really. What I'm doing, what am I talking about? Very, very simple. What I'm saying is this. We've been praying. You've You've said it with your mouth now that it has a spiritual on that road. We've been praying and it is not working out. So it means our prayers are ineffective. It means that God is not interested in our prayer. God doesn't want to answer us for the reason based on to God. Because He is God. He can do whatever He wants to do. So all I believe and I know is that since it's a spiritual problem, and let us try another solution and cure them. My wife and your wife, that's what I mean. My brother, where is your faith? Remember Job. Remember Job. I don't know Job. I don't know Job. I don't Job. Because that's not called Job. First reality doesn't Job. My brother, my Bible says in the first book of Peter, chapter 5, verse 10, mm -hmm. that the God of all grace, who has called us to his eternal glory through Jesus Christ. After ye has suffered for a while, underline that, after ye has suffered for a while, shall perfect you, strengthen you, establish you, and then settle you, my brother. After ye has suffered for a while. Huh? Do not blaspheme. The woman and your mom will not carry you. They will come on at you. If your mom take it from you, they will come on at you. What do you mean? Give me that thing you come on and see you wish on. They are blaspheming. Blaspheming for how? But you want to get there? So no, 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 no. Money is not enough. But that is not enough. But they blaspheme. Now you are coming on that money. You, 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 you
I don't, I don't like that. Don't you do that with Blasheva. Don't you do that with Blasheva. Don't you do that with Blasheva. This life is full of confusion, temptation, all over the nation. Oh, should I cry? Should I weep? Oh, I want to cry. I want to cry. Sanu me pere. In this case, guys, I don't know what anyone else thinks. Our mom suffering from the same ailment at the same time. It's not just a mere coincidence. There must be something behind it. Of course, something is behind it. Or has your dad not told you that? What? what? Wait a minute. You mean your dad has not told you? What, what now? Man? Your dad didn't tell you that there's a certain oracle that is behind all that we've been passing through. Oracle. There is this certain family oracle that our forefathers used to send. And now they need sacrifices from our dads. But they refused. So, so, so you mean the oracle is the one behind all this that has been happening? Exactly. And our families have embarked on fervent prayers to stop the oracle. I'm surprised you people don't know about it. Oh my god. So you mean mom is going to die? You can see yes. nothing will happen to mom. Mom will be fine, okay? Sure. Yes. That's it. And that is right, okay? Nothing will happen to your mom. All you guys need to do is Jonathan prayers. Believe God that all this will soon be over. Okay? She'll be fine. Then I'll have to talk to dad about this. I wonder why he has been keeping silence. All this why. Oh, it's surprising. Mom, nothing will happen to you. I think you'll be fine, okay? Oh, wow.
Young man, do not be afraid. Yes, do not think too difficult for the great angel. The light that shines from the great beyond. The health of your wife shall be restored. Oh, thank you. Great one, thank you. Thank you very, very much. I am so happy, thank you. What about the test results? The results are out. But they say that nothing is wrong with her. The doctors don't understand this. It has defied medical reasoning. Huh? I, 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 if there's I nothing wrong with her, well, how come her body is like this? How come she cannot stand? Eh? What is all this now? What is all this? Give me him, Captain. Eh? This affliction is not ordinary. Therefore, require extraordinary power to deal with it. Therefore, whatever you see here, your mind sealed. You mean you have not done that business you said you have with uh, Mazi Bekwe's granddaughter? No, Mama. Why? Is it because we asked you to avoid her? Not really, Mama. No. I think Edith is in kind of serious trouble. What kind of trouble? <laughs> the other day I left for the city. I met her on the road, collapsed with a bullet wound. Bullet wound? Yes, Papa. Probably she was shot by the police. <laughs> because she refused to report the case to the police or even go to the hospital. Hmm? And she warned me not to tell anybody, not even her parents. Hmm. Okay, the other day the police came to my house looking for her. I don't know what is going on. I don't know. You see? Have you seen for yourself why we want you to avoid that girl and her family like a plague? Have you seen for yourself? That girl is evil. They are dangerous people. Whoever that associates with that family will definitely get into trouble. Who knows what uh, crime she has even committed? Oh. Eh? Listen, my daughter. Stay away from that girl. <laughs> Stay clear from her. Whatever business you had with her, stop it. Whatever amount of money is involved, forget it. Yes. Your life comes first. Yes. But it's not all about business. Edith is my sister. I just wish she could just open up to me so I can help her. May Amadio her strike your mouth. Who is your sister? Who do you want to help? Look, Choma, if you refuse to stay away from her, I shall disown you. Ha! Papa, it has not got into it. It has got into it. I don't fear. It has got into it. I don't bam bam more. It has got into it. I don't 
And if we know who, come and make sure you get there. If you don't stay away from it, you will see what you are looking for. He will not only destroy you. I, your mother, will also destroy you. So start from now to disassociate yourself from anything that has to do with that family. If you know you are not looking for my trouble, and I'm not here. What? But you invited a native doctor to kill your wife? And he did. Philip won and he did. Ah, the most important thing in the world will go if we go mad or And the most important thing that he healed my wife and uh, how he healed my wife does not matter to me. It should matter to you. It shouldn't matter to me. I said it should matter to you. Do you know you just invited the devil into your house? Oh, devil. Oh, devil on our first boy. I won't know if devil will my money is evil devil. My man said he was a good devil. What are you talking about? I said I invited somebody and he used her to kill my wife. Or some devil. Devil on our boy. What are you telling me? And he told me that your, 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 your prayers could not hear. Is that what you think? That, that, that's what it is. That is it. Look at what you said. You stop on and What you are proving is stubbornness. Yes, it's, it's, it's not it. This is very ineffective prayers. Be very, very careful. Be very, very careful because your children will never give you the anything about to their mother. Yes, you should know this. So you presume to run my family? No, are you not the one running my family? Tell me, are you not the one running my family? How my wife got healed? Why, why should they be bothering you like that? I said, are you not the one running my family? Bob, I promise you this. You will regret this. You don't know if there's anybody in this world that will regret it. It is you. It is you! Because if anything... <laughs> if anything happens to your wife, Oh, you will live to regret it because your children will never forgive you. But you see, you are my brother no matter what you're doing. You are still my blood brother. I will still be there for you if you change your mind. Bring the woman out to take the warrior. God forbid. Get behind me, Satan. Oh, but I'm going to hear you. 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 Until your wife dies. I'm going to hear you. Satan, I'm going to hear you. I'm going to hear you. I know you're going through pains right now, but by the grace of God Almighty, you'll be fine. Okay? Just stay strong for me. I hope she's taking her drugs. She is, but she's not getting any better. She's obviously not getting better, but I'm sure she'll be fine. This is her. Seriously? Yes, but she has been killed now. She's killed? How many age? How? God forbid! Little doctor! No. I know this is a very bad situation, but little doctor is strictly out of it. And she accepted that? I, I don't even think she's aware of it. He didn't tell anybody, even dad wasn't aware of it. I'm sure if he was, he wouldn't have allowed it. God. God. Mm. Mm. I don't worry. Mm. It's well. Mm. You'll be fine. Mm. The Lord will serve will heal you. Mm. Jesus. Mm. This is too much. Come down. Uh, great one. I am here to show my heartfelt gratitude. Was all that you have done for me with this uh, little thing in my hand. <laughs> what is that? And once again, once again, I am very, very happy. You are indeed the greatest. <laughs> Do not rejoice yet, for it is not over until it is over. I, I, I don't understand. How do you mean? The spirit will still come back with a fatal blow unless something is done to stop it. What will be, tell me whatever that will be done to stop it? In order to remove the altar of your forefathers, another altar must be erected. Uh, 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 great one. No problem. However, just tell me. Just tell me how it can be erected. Sweetheart, I am not comfortable with this place. Of all things, I don't know. I chose this place because it's quiet and peaceful. I understand. That's why I did not protest when you suggested we should hang out. 
but Cass and I frequent this place. I can't see him here. I can't see him anywhere here. He's not close to this place. And I'm sure he's not his spirit. He wouldn't know we're here. Listen, they're trying to jail me for something I never did. You know I didn't kill those men. I am innocent. You have nothing to worry about. Okay? Okay. Okay, fine. What do you care for? I already ordered for snack for myself. I'll take one. Hello? Make it two. So what do I get you? Okay, fine. I'll eat no Okay. That's nice. So, Axel? I'm, I'm good. It's just, I'm just chilling out. Looks like uh, you're with somebody. Probably a lady. Yeah, I am. Uh, I was with someone now. Uh, but come to think of it, why do you think uh, it's a lady? Obviously, we have two bottles of snap here. Yeah? Drinking one, so. Okay, yeah, beauty is charged. You see, um. Actually, I was with someone and um, she left a few minutes before you arrived. I see. Yeah. Ben, are you okay? Mm. I'm fine. I'm just good. Yeah. Why don't I fix you up with something? Uh, no, like I told you, I've, I've, I've placed an order already. Okay. Um, uh, ben, have you by any chance seen a idiot? No, no. After you told me that uh, she escaped the police custody, I must see her. No. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Um, in case you happen to run into Edith, I want you to relay this message to her. Okay. Tell her she can only run but she can never hide. I'm going to apprehend her. And when I do, things might not work out the way everybody expects, including you. So, would you be kind enough to relay this message to her, Ben? Well, that would be if I see her. Try. I'll do that. That's what I'm talking about. Um, waiter!
The light that shines from the blue beyond. This sacrifice is offered to you to illuminate the life of Bob in the way. Daughters remain a mystery to me. Oh. But I am trying the best I can. Nothing, nothing will ever happen to any of your family again. I promise you. Nothing will ever happen again. I don't know what to believe anymore. Father, if I be a man of God. why it killed my daughter, knowing how precious she was to me. Chai, what do I do now? Whom do I run to for protection? Because I'm sure that wicked oracle is bent on wiping away my family. If you be it, it will succeed. You will 
What's that? Are you sure you can handle this alone? My son, we are not alone. The Spirit of the Lord Almighty is with us. The God that restored your mother's health, the God that broke the chains of sickness and captivity is with us. God will go with us to the village tomorrow. I will lead a team of some of my prayer warriors to go and remove that oracle from our family. Okay, oh. but what about Uncle, Uncle Bob? My son, I do not need your uncle. God Almighty is with me. You see, your uncle has always been the black sheep of the family. He's my elder brother, yes. But do you know that at the age of 20, he left home and went to Lagos. He spent many years there, no one ahead of him. I got married before him. It was... Uh, a few years after your birth and that of your sister that I got information as to his whereabouts in Lagos. I went in search of him. I brought him back home. Seriously. It took the family's intervention to get him to settle down. We found a wife for him and funded his wedding. Everything about it. That is business. I started it for him. Yes. So it was not just quite long ago that he started attending church and everything. To get him to fully accept Christ has always been a problem. So my son, right now, your uncle has lost his faith. God Almighty, we go into the village. Memo. There is power mighty in the blood. There is power mighty in the blood. There is power mighty in the blood of Jesus Christ. There is power mighty in the Lord. In the Lord. There is power mighty in the Lord. There is power mighty in the blood of Jesus Christ. There is power
We will speak in new tongues. Yes. Brothers and sisters, begin to pray. Pray against any demon that is in this compound. Pray against any altar that is in this compound that is not of Jesus Christ. Oh, begin to pray, pray, my brothers. Pray, pray to put down any altar of God. Any altar that is not of God. Begin to pray and bring them down. Oh, Father. We say whatever we found here on earth shall be bound in heaven. And anything we have said over shall be set free. My Lord, my Father. We command every other, everyone in this compound, every power from the pit of hell, who has descended against the name of Jesus, we command it to be destroyed now. We pray through in any shadow of the weekend of our life, and command it to be destroyed. Let us have a son of God. Come down from the high of the sanctuary this morning. I begin to pull every tree that is not planted by you in this compound. I command it to be the kind of situation that evil thing turned my innocent daughter into. Please, I want to wait for me. We all believe she was guilty. Something kept telling me there's something behind it. I wasn't couldn't just figure it out. I want to for me. I my innocent daughter. I'm sure this. I give God the glory for finally giving us victory. Amen. Mm. We just have to pray. We have to pray so that God, who we serve, will make the police to understand that Edith is innocent. He will show you to me. Amen. 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 Amelia, please! Such a high rank! Who plows the black king? My name. Virgin Spirit! Moving up the slow and hill! What's your own? The power of the book! Oh, <laughs> 
nothing to do with you. It's not about you. I wish not to talk about it, but believe me, it's not about you. It has nothing to do with you, so can we forget it? Don't even give me that bullshit. I demand you start telling me what I need to know right here, right now. As who? No, tell me. As what? What is wrong with you? I am trying to explain things to you and here you are shouting and yelling at me as if I'm a child. Is it because I'm in your house? If you want me to leave, I will leave and stop shouting at me. Don't even play a smart one. Don't! I advise you to be more creative. Oh. Ah! You stupid! Stop ah! here! Oh.
What is this? One week, one trouble. Troubles that prayer cannot solve. God, don't let me be put to shame. Do not let the idol worshippers laugh at me. I thought your father said he destroyed everything. Samia. So I thought. But it's not true. I saw the oracle. It's still much active. It's okay. It's okay. It's Juma. okay. Juma. It's okay. Baby, baby, it's okay. Juma. It's okay. Juma. Because she just died like that. It's okay. It's okay. Just take it easy, okay? It's not okay. It's not okay. They will say I'm the one that killed her. It is not okay. I was here to ask the victim some questions when I saw Edie leaving the compound. And by the time I walked in here, I found the girl dead. What beats my imagination is that they are both related. So, why would Edie kill her own relative? Why would she do that? <sighs> Do you, by any chance, think that evil spirit could be responsible for this? Don't give me that, Spencer Cats. I don't believe in such bullshit. The evil spirit I saw leaving the compound is Edith. And she has to answer to all of them. This is becoming more confusing. Oh, 
No, Papa. She died in your house. And the last person that was with her I was Edith. What's the case, What? This is what That is what Edith said. My confession is that after all the prayers and deliverance sessions, the still thing persists. Ouch. Dad, what is going on? What is that is going on? My son, I am short of words. Now what have you done? What is all this happening to us? You see, our God sends his son to shine on evil men and good men alike. He sends rain to fall on the just and the unjust. Hmm? Temptations may fall on the righteous. But remember, many are the afflictions of the righteous. But the good Lord delivers them from all. This is too much. This is too much. We are human. This is too much. My granddaughter, Eddie, that's not possible. How do you mean it's not possible? How do you mean it's not possible? When the people at the scene of the crime told me that your granddaughter killed my daughter, you are not telling me that it's not possible. No, it's not possible. No, I'm okay, okay. I know you lost your daughter. You have every right to be angry. But you know this family. You know Pastor Philip. You know Edith. You know, Edith cannot possibly kill your daughter. There is something wrong somewhere. Will you shut up your mind there? Will you shut up your mind there? Look, listen, listen to me. I will get to the root of this matter and ensure that I avenge the death of my daughter. Your granddaughter cannot kill my daughter and go for free. No way! No way! She must pay daily for it. She must pay daily for it. Calm down. And you will hear from me. You will hear from me. You will hear from me. Okay, okay. We, we, we. Evil family, evil people, you will hear from me. Is full of confusion, temptation, all of our invasion. Should I be? Should I be? Dad, what is going on? I thought you said you destroyed the oracle. What is happening? My dear, I do not know. I do not understand. But I give God the glory. You give God the glory? That you give God the glory, you give God the glory, you keep giving God the glory while I keep hiding from one place to another. The police are searching for me everywhere and once they get me, I'll rot in jail for something I never did. But I can't, I can't continue like this. My dear, trust in the Lord. He will see us through. Hmm? He will give us victory. I should trust in the Lord? That seriously, I am confused. I don't even know what to believe anymore. My dear, Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Lean not on your own understanding, but in every way acknowledge Him so that He will direct your paths. Only. It is now. It is now. How is Mom and everyone? We're fine. We're fine.
Because he has Stella, I'll go on. I'm scared. I don't want to die. I'm afraid too. That I may be the next to die. No! It's me. I'm having feelings. I'm just pretending, but I'm scared to my bone. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. My children, I have you. I have help with them. But I want to assure both of you, you are not going to die. Nothing will happen to you. Alright? Yes. Don't you. Don't be scared. Hmm? 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 Considering the our understanding, we expected you to come to us first, so that we deliberate on this and know the last step to take. That you going to the village to humiliate our sister, and you know the condition, the health condition of our father. Jude. I mean, it's wrong. Because, uh, what For how long will I be patient? My name is not patient, my name is Jude. Then for how long will I be patient? It's not that you have miscarriage. I came to you, Pastor. You prayed. I'm still waiting for the answer to your prayers. The text that I came to you, you! You and I took her to the teaching hospital. And the doctor said that nothing is wrong with her. Now this is the thing that we're miscarried. And what do you expect me to do? Oh, I'm to put you. Oh, till the damn one. That is why I sent her back. On a roof here, there's a roof for another wife. That took me a missing one from her. Then I'll be a father. Now let me ask you one question. How many children do you have? Oh, 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 o
<laughs> there was a time you called him and prayed for him. Now when people are belly, Ibel. 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 Philip Ibel. Did you want to know? Don't tell me! I want to get a little bit of 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 a little Hey, Brother, um, I was the meeting with uh, Richard husband. I hope he was correct. Not if you want to remember that meeting. I don't want to remember that meeting. It was a terrible one. That man vowed never to continue that marriage. Hey, this was how my husband still brought me back to this village. He brought me back here without coming for me. Not even a call, nothing. He left me here. I know it's a problem also, but the one that bothers me is only self and self. What can I carry when I am? What can I do with that? The onions won't be. I join him for all. I want Baba. Hmm. What can I do with him? How are you feeling? I feel so weak. I'm weaker, weaker by the hour. Not even only by the hour, but by the minute. I've been stooling all day. I'm not even a single appetite. So what am I living for? You will not die. Papa, you will not die. Eh? Can you be talking about that now? What do you want me to do? Anyway, Papa, let me tell you because I look everywhere in this place. There's no good cause for you. So I want to take you to the town. I want to take you to the town. So that I'll take you to a very good hospital. I can take you to any hospital and you'll be taken care of. So I want to take you to a very good hospital. So that you'll be taken care of. Oh, I can I can watch you go down like this. Yes, my son. But my mind tells me that this problem is not ordinary. I think it is spiritual, not even hospital. That is the only way I think the solution will come. If I agree.
kill that innocent child. Baby, I'm tired of seeing the same movie all the time. Come on, darling. You know, it's my best. Let's just watch it. I want to change. Okay. Anything for you. Thank you, baby. Let me change. Sweetheart. What is wrong? I need some fresh air. Okay. You think, can I come with you? No. I want to go alone. Okay. You just don't stay out late. You know the police are still looking for you. Don't worry, I can take care of myself. Okay. She's not big in her calls. Officer, let's call the manager to the reception. Where is that?
Hello, Cubs. Hello, Ben. What's up? He did has just murdered another man in cold blood right now. What? What are you talking about? What happened? Now listen to me, Ben. If I were you, I would hand Edith over. That is, if I were you. Hey, hello, Cass. Listen. Hello. Hello. Hello, this is Inspector Cass. Who made true to the forensic department? Edith, what have you done this time? Edith, where are you coming from? What have you done this time? Talk to me, because my patient is weary me. What have you done this time? Getting more confused. I am getting confused more and more. Eh? How can the spirit of a boy you use for sacrifice be haunting me, haunting me everywhere? I mean, I mean, I can't understand it. You should have, you should have taken care of this from the first day. Yes. The light I sign out from Gay Beyond. Talk to me. What is wrong? Young man, do not worry. I will change the spirit. Yes. Where? Cops, you're welcome. Please, I'll uh, uh, There will be no need for the formalities. We are not here to stay. For the sake of peace and out of the respect I have for you as my friend, I want you to quietly hand over Edith to us. Cops. Like I told you before, I don't know where she is. Then you will leave me with no other option than to place you under arrest. Arrest me? For what? For harboring a wanted criminal. Did you hear that, Cass? I'm your friend, you can't do this to me. <laughs> Mr. Ben, you are under arrest for harboring a serial killer. You have the right to remain silent. Because anything you say here will be used against you in the court of law. Cass. You just can't do this to me. You just can't do this to me. Leave him. Inspector Cars, arrest me. Baby. Take me. As long as you continue to fight, I will give you whatever you want. Whenever you're hungry, I will feed you. Now I want to feed you.
Okay, no problem. What kind of dream is this? Where are we? We are in Port Road. We're turn heading back. to turn, airport. Turn back, turn back. Yeah? Turn back, turn back. Hey! No, no, no. Turn back. Hey! I'm not going again. Shut up and drive. Shut up. Hi! Believe I never knew it would be like this ever. I never knew that the stuff was wasn't my company. I thought that the native doctor would take care of this. Instead, he, he complicated my everything. He complicated everything. Now as I'm talking to you, I can't sleep in my house. I can't do anything again. I am, I am, I am. I don't know what to say. Yes. Because either the oracle is pursuing me. Holy Spirit is pursuing me. Hey! My brother, the only solution is to give your life to Jesus Christ. Huh? He's the only solution to what we face right now. Oh, believe me. The man of God. No, 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 no. The man of God called Jesus. The man of God. The man of God. The man of God. The man of God called Jesus. The man of God. My brother. Our God is the same merciful God. Hmm? There is nothing you have done that God cannot forgive. Feel it. Yes, but your brother sitting down here. You're my blood brother. I want to have any more so I can hide everything from you. I shed blood. You go to the level one. As a match of stainless blood, we go to the level one. Come where so easy, where so easy. Since our prayer was not working. That's why I said, "Be mindful that you have it." This kind of sin. You did what? But I warned you. But I warned you. I know you want me. It's not what we're talking about now. I know you are a pastor. Oh my goodness, you have a dangerous prayer. The only solution to my problem now is this. Where Pele can walk, pray a dangerous way, let me die. Just where Pele can walk, and that's that. It's me, you're the only one that can walk, praise him, because. Please. No. My brother, the word of God says in Isaiah 118 Come, let us reason together. Give me your hands, my brother. Give me your hands. Oh, the dangerous way. Come, 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 come. Come, let us reason together. For though your sins may be as scarlet, they will be made as white as snow. Though they be red like crimson, they will be as wool. My brother, let us time you accept Jesus into your life as your personal Lord and Savior. Can you please save me? Can you please save me? I want to say after me, Lord Jesus Christ, I come before you in all humility. I come before you in all humility. Forgive me of all my sins. Forgive me of all my sins. Wash me and make me holy. Wash me and make me holy. I am sorry for everything I have done. I am sorry for everything. I accept you into my life as my Lord and personal Savior. I accept you into my life. As my Lord and personal sin. With all my heart. With all my heart. With all my strength. With all my strength. With all my soul. With all my soul. For your word says. For your word says. That when a man is in Christ Jesus. When a man is in Christ Jesus. He is a new creature. He is a new creature. That all things are passed away. All things are passed And all things are made new. And all things are made new. Thank you Jesus for having me. Thank you Jesus for having me. Thank you Jesus. Thank you Jesus. 
Father, by the authority you have given me as a servant of yours, I decree and I declare today that he is now a new creature in Jesus' name. Amen. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We have to find the family of that boy to restitute. Yes. Even if we don't find it, if we don't find the family, God in heaven knows that we have tried, but we must search for them. Relax. Now watch the manifestation of the work of God in your life. It is well in Jesus' name. Amen. I conducted a series of prayers on behalf of his family last night. And the Lord revealed so many things to me. For the Lord, we are more than conquerors. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. <laughs> I do say that. I'm worried. You know, I don't like it when you call us up like this. What is the matter? After Pastor Mwam had prayed for our family, I thought that our problems would have been over by now. But up till now, it seems as if the problems are growing from bad to worse. Papa, the worst is that Pastor is still complaining. Mm. And Brother Bob's case is something else. Mm. I wanted to say it, but I don't know what I will say that will put me in trouble. That is why I kept quiet. Please, honestly, I don't like the way we are sounding. Not especially you, Papa. We are counting on you. Eh? We start saying all these things. What do you expect us to do? Eh? Let's not talk and act like people who has lost hope. God is still on the throne. There's nothing too difficult for him to do. Oh, Papa. So strong an animal. Oh, uh, you need another human sacrifice. Look what did you say? What, what did I do? I said you need another human sacrifice. Oh, you will sacrifice your mother, sacrifice your father, sacrifice your children, sacrifice your own village, sacrifice everything. I say more trouble, boy. Then I do it. The altar of light is here. If you don't do it, you will die. I deny any man. He can't do it. No, I deny any man. We tell my brother that. What am I die? Let me die. I can't do it. What am I This is just the tip of the iceberg. <laughs> Oh, 
Why is he making? 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 Why is he making?
In the name of Jesus, yes. Pastor Philip, open it and remove everything there. Remove it, bring it out. Bring it out. Okay, bring it. What are you here now? You know me. Bring it to Pastor. Bring it to Pastor. Bring it to Bring it to Pastor. Bring it to Pastor. Bring it to Pastor. This one caught here, this one caught here. Then I said, I one.
I believe you were contracted to kill those people you murdered in cold blood. Now tell me, who are you working for? Who are you working for? I am not working for anyone. I am innocent. I've said this before, and I am saying it again. I didn't kill anyone. I know you might be scared to say the truth about those men that are involved in this. But I assure you, if you tell me the truth, the state will protect you and those men behind this series of murder will be nailed. Now tell me, Edith, who are you working for? I am not working for anyone. What's it, Edith? Who are you working for? I am not working for anyone. Power of God for us to hold and the power of God. Amen. 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 ago. Yes. Hey. 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 Hey! 
This deity that I will assign to your family will remain for eternity. I will erect this altar with human blood. Do you agree? Yes, yes, yes we, we agree. agree. We agree. Hmm. Alpha Mefuna. Good one. Ibekwe will not die. Take him home. Thank you. Thank you. Good one. Good one. Good one. that Akataka cannot be wrong. Yes. Sit. In the quick. Father. Father. I'm hungry. You're hungry? I'm hungry, Father. Adora, go inside. Prepare something good for him to eat now. Oh, now, please. In the quick. In the quick. It's fine. I told you a kataka can never be wrong. That means we have to perform that sacrifice. Sure. We must. We have to. Keep it quick. Can I see you stand? Can you? Yes, my God. After this sacrifice, all the affliction in your family will disappear. And none will ever die untimely again. Circle the light on his head seven times. This light will continue to shine if you will do what I'm about to say now. Afamefuna. You will come before this deity every year with a she goat to perform the sacrifice. And this will continue in your lineage forever. Hey! Hey! Oh, 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 oh,
Jesus. How did I get to this place? What am I doing here? Exactly what happened that day. Jesus. 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 Oh, my God. 
Hello, this is Inspector Cass. I need medics immediately at airport road. I repeat, I need medics immediately. Thank you. 